find will be less about lecture and more about interaction when we're very broad. Now that, not to say we aren't going to lecture at you, because you know as professors we feel we have all this wonderful knowledge and we want to share it with you. But we find with a lot of, where the real deep learning does take place is when you're interacting and wrestling with the ideas. And you'll find you'll get a lot of opportunity to do that whilst you're broad. So what we did here today was invited students who have an 85 average coming from high school and, uh, and we really want to invite them to come to Brock and, and really see what the benefits of a Brock University education are. So number one, I'm going to introduce two transitional issues. Number two, we're going to talk about strategies for success. And again, it's about you helping them. I'm going to try to help you help them. The third one is how you can help. That's going to be throughout. And the last one, I'm going to leave you with five tips so that you guys can adapt along with them. Because as they're changing, believe it or not, you're going to need to change too. Meredith Simon. I work in the Faculty of Business and I manage international exchange programs just for the business students. Um, every year I'm sending more and more students as everybody starts to realize the value of the experience. It's, um, we have over 30 partner schools around the world. Most of them are in Europe and most of our students go to Europe. I think it's really important for a parent to come to our, our uh, A-team experience for several reasons, but probably the primary one is to really find out a little bit about our university. The key ingredient between success and failure for a student is that they fit in to the culture of the, uh, of the university they're going to go to. And the best way to find that out is to come and experience it firsthand. We do have many, many different ways for you to get involved, and I'm mainly going to talk to you on a fairly casual basis about everything you can do while you're here. We do have the BSA, which is the umbrella organization to our seven other student associations, which are faculty of business exclusive. You will see when you get here, there are hundreds of clubs, literally, that you can get involved with here on campus, but we do have eight, as I mentioned, that are specific just to you as faculty of business students. It will change your entire experience. If you're a student who just goes to class and you go home and you don't really get involved in things like that, you're really just not going to get that full experience. And I can honestly say from personal experience, it will change your life. I really like the university. It has a great campus. It seems really new, so there's a lot of stuff going on. The extracurricular activities here seem really interesting and um, the program that I'm looking to go into, the accounting co-op, it looks really fun and it's a really organized program to get my CA to become a forensic accountant. We have over 2,000 students in co-op at this university. When I started here 10 years ago, we had five students in the business program and it has just blossomed. Accounting is actually 30 years old. We've had the accounting co-op for quite some time. The business co-op program is only 11 years old. You know, being that you are in a co-op program, there's going to be more demands placed on you than the average student. So it's good to know this coming into the co-op program that it is, you know, it is going to be a little bit more work than just being in the regular program. Um, while you're in school managing all your projects and a social life, you're also going to have to be applying to jobs prepping your resume, prepping for interviews. So there are additional demands placed on you as a co-op student. The opportunities you will gain, the friendships you will, you will create that are lasting throughout your entire life, it's just, it truly makes the most of your entire experience while you're here at Brock.